how you guys doing i hope your family's okay i hope you guys are fine my name is shayo and i'm going to be your host for today now we're gonna start with an icebreaker question like we usually do so my question today is what makes you feel better when you're sad now for me i'm gonna answer first so for me ice cream makes me feel better when i'm sad i just love strawberry ice cream so when i'm sad i just get myself some ice cream and a big scoop and i feel better again so what makes you feel better when you're sad today we're going to be talking about a very interesting story and that is the story of king jehoshaphat now this story can be found in second chronicles 19 to 20. now king jehoshaphat was a very good king and he did good things but some people did not like the good things king jehoshaphat was doing so the enemies came together and decided to start a war against King Jehoshaphat. And then King Jehoshaphat was really scared. Can I see your scared face? When I'm scared, I look like this. And sometimes, don't tell anyone, but sometimes I start to cry. So King Jehoshaphat got it all the people in his kingdom together and they pray can you put your hands like this let's pretend like we're praying and they told God how great he is and they asked God to help them because they were scared and did not know what to do then suddenly a priest came and said do not be afraid you will not have to fight this battle the Lord will save you King Jehoshaphat and all the people heard this message and they thanked God for promising to save them. Can I hear you say, thank you, Jesus? Now, so the next day, King Jehoshaphat and his people marched. Can I hear you marching? They marched to the enemy ground to fight the enemy. And when they got there, they realized that they were no, there was no great army to fight. The enemies fought against each other and killed each other. The people were so happy and they cheered for God and they thanked him for saving them because the, before they got there, the battle had already been won. King Jehoshaphat and his army returned home praising God. They thanked God for saving them and for helping them when they felt scared. Now, no matter how we feel, we can be like King Jehoshaphat and be thankful because when you're thankful, you're happy. I want to hear you say after me, when I'm thankful, I'm happy. When I'm thankful, I'm happy. And so, what are you thankful for? Me, For me, I'm thankful to be alive. So guys, now we're going to do the memory verse. And so I want you guys to repeat after me. Rejoice always, pray continually, and give thanks in all circumstances. Can you repeat after me? Rejoice always, pray continually, and give thanks in all circumstances. And our memory verse is gotten from 1 Thessalonians 5 verse 16. Hey guys, it's craft time! So now for today, or craft today is something very fun and very interesting. You're gonna need a rock, some paint, and some markers. So what we're gonna do is get a rock and wash it, and we're gonna try it till it's nice and dry. And we're gonna get some paint and paint the rock whatever color you want absolutely anything and then you get some markers and you can draw whatever it is you want on the rock and now when we're done with that we done decorating the rock and it looks so beautiful we're gonna keep the rock in the jar and whenever you're sad or scared or your feelings are just out of control you get the rock we're gonna call this rock a thankful rock say thankful rock now you get the rock and you you hold it in your hands and you put your hands together and we're going to pray and thank God for anything. Just say something you're thankful for. 
and we're doing this because remember we are happy when we are thankful we are happy when we are thankful so we're gonna do this to make us happy so now guys it's time to pray so i want you guys to put your hands together like this and close your eyes and let's pray father god we thank you because you are always here to comfort us help us to feel that you are near today we love you and you are the best amen so now guys i hope you guys stay safe i hope you guys are good be good to your parents and i miss you and i love you stay safe bye